What's going on, everybody? Finally back again. Um, continuing the Metal Gear series. So today, in a Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake. Once again, like I said with Metal Gear, never played either of these two. So it'll be interesting playing uh, this one, and actually I'm probably going to have to do the same thing and do the first one and look up a guide. But we'll see how far I can get through it in the meantime. But let's just jump right into it. Also, sorry if I feel sound a bit stuffy. Goddamn, of course, I'm fine the whole day and I get back to the house and my allergies kick in. Okay, so I read the description. So this is uh, the Zanzibar land, which I don't know if it's going to have uh, more with... Uh... What was his name? The... the samurai, the robot samurai guy. Because I remember they talk about him in Metal Gear 2, not 2, the Twin Snakes. We're not Twin Snakes. It was two. Metal Gear 2. They make the joke. Also, I'm not gonna skip this. The, the opening credits. There might be something special. I mean, it's a lot of blueprints of the new Metal Gear. So it's got like some kind of like laser targeting system, which is weird for a nuke launcher. I feel like you don't want to be anywhere that a laser can see. It sounds like a bad idea. Very funky music, though. I can tell you that much. These are gonna be some long credits, ain't they? So I feel like those ain't the ICBMs. I feel like that's just the missile launcher. Is this just a mech? I thought Metal Gear is all supposed to be about launching nukes. Like, zoom and enhance on the penis gun. So I guess it's got self-defense on it now, which would make sense because the last one just sat there and got blown up. So they're like, it needs to defend itself in case everyone's gone. Metal Gear 2, new and improved. Alright, yeah, the 1990s, the world's marked in an age of peace and stability. And Big Boss is like, not on my watch. Do I have to hit X? I don't want to skip something on accident. Okay. Relations between the Cold War superpowers have thawed. Regional conflicts are being resolved. The threat of nuclear war is now a thing of the past. Nice pistol. So... Some who do not desire peace. Yeah, so it's basically the, uh... The everybody who's like, uh, the diamond dogs and stuff. Uh, everybody who's... The mercenaries and, uh... Just men of war. Amateur attention begins to build in the Middle East. The 
military junta. Zanzibar land, small nation, border in the USSR, China, the Middle East. Oh, okay, so, so they went and stole nukes, and now they're like, we're gonna fight everybody, and you can't just blow us up, because we'll just nuke you. We're announcing nukes forever, the world is once again threatened by the specter of nuclear war. So this is all orchestrated by Big Boss for a reason, or at least he took advantage of it. Supply, which has lasted over 30 years, suddenly and unexpectedly dries up with a stable turn of source for energy. The world faces a severe energy crisis. Now, say, I remember that. In, in the real world. It was in these dire circumstances that Dr. Kiyomar, a uh, biologist, develops oil. A microbe that can synthesize high-grade petroleum. Well, where is that in the real world? Was <laughs> that just synthetic gas? For this discovery, global tensions are once again on the rise. On his way to attend an American scientific conference, Dr. Barb is kidnapped by agents of Zanzibar. They're like, we gotta send, send this. Wide clone of a hunk of a man with its nuclear weapons and the secret oil X, oil nine, sends our land plans to achieve global military domination. They're like, we know we're one city, but tiny microbe, only a few microns wide, is about to change the world forever. Why, thank you, PlayStation. Second intro? Have I missed something? I didn't even start the damn game. At least we know all the backstory now. Alright, so it's starting to be climbing up a mountain this time, not... Swimming. I got full health right away. The snake have reached the infiltration point. Oh, it's Colonel Campbell. Snake right on time as always. Let's get started. Commencing operation intrude F014. Over this one more time, you wish to infiltrate Sansibar Lane and rescue the kidnapped Sedge bio biologist, Dr. Kiyomarv. Friday with new anti-personal sensor. Try switching it on. It's on. Oh, that's fantastic! Okay, the white dot's on your radar, enemy soldier with the red dot is your current position. The red dot is equipped with several other types of sensors as well, they should warn you of any unseen dangers. Okay, that one skipped away too quick. Uh, take a look at your radar, it only displays a 9 screen area, center in your position, however, it may not work in small, enclosed spaces. Also, if the enemy spots you, you won't be able to use the radar, the enemy will use a jammer to scramble it. Got it, we're gonna find Dr. Marv. Dr. Marv has a transmitter implanted in one of his molar teeth. Get close to him, he'll show up as a red dot in your radar. Okay, some of these are skipping way too quick. Does it auto go? Snake, use frequency 85. Pro future communications. No. I'm just fat pranker in, I guess. Good luck over and out. Okay. So, radar this time is cool. And there's a turnaround time. But not if I. So, it's slower to turn around than it is to just. Bloop. can't see me. You can go to the left or the right. Ah, so the hole in the fence. 
He's crawling, yep. Oh, is that a truck? I feel like I could have went in the truck. Ooh, okay. So yeah, they switch screens. Pork, beef, ham, eggs, tuna fish, chocolate, and crackers. I'm gonna do my best to not kill anybody. Because I feel like it would make things more interesting. That's true Metal Gear way. Alright, I've failed that plan immediately. They're all going down now. I guess my decision has been changed. Ha, you can't shoot me, suckers. Okay. Things ain't doing too good because of the whole this. Situation. I know, the shit's hit the fan. You can't sneak in through the front door, use the vents. Sit here and punch everyone that comes out now. Alright, I've killed everyone. Is that the vent? Oh, there's a vent. I got messed up immediately. Triple kill. Okay. Just keep hiding. Okay. Into this event. I've so severely screwed up my sneaking too. Ah, uh, this is what he was saying. So, like, vents and stuff, I won't have a radar. Okay, then, hold on. Hey, the loading screen threw me off. What is this way, then? Oh, unless it's that hole. I might just fall out the top side, but we're gonna find out. Yeah, look at that, I got some ammo. Yep. At least I didn't fall out immediately. All right, same building, different side. Ow. Okay, I thought I could, like, jump or something. Alright, I'm out. I screwed up. I'm gonna go to the other side. I'm gonna take my ammo with me.
Alright, now is there a way down here? Or am I missing a button? There's a way down. Holly. Holly White. I traded to Zanzibar Land a month ago, posing as a journalist. So I know pretty much how things work around there. I'll help you any way I can. My frequency is 14015. Okay. Why does that look like a room full of enemies? It's always down. I guess it's not down this time. It's funny you can move around in the elevator now, though. Okay. Done enough. Me too. Beans and meatballs. Beans and franks and beef and potatoes. There's a lot of beans. Oh, hello. Card one. somewhere. Nothing. You ain't here shit. Okay, so that's level two. It sucks I'm gonna have to start remembering these doors again. Nothing, go away. Probably how I should be playing the game. Sneaking around and such. Lies! How did you know?
Oh, okay. I don't have the card out. Oh. Did that help? Okay, so I got a breath gauge. Cut the gas mask that... You know what? Nope. Into the dust shoot. Damn. Okay, so I can just get random items? Oh, so you sometimes can get a ration, and then I lost that one. Which sucks. There we go. So I'm in like the sewers now. Those mines? Okay, so it's all locked up. So I'm in, yeah, the second floor basement. Can you go any further down? Oh, oh boy, okay. Yeah, these maps are gonna be... This is gonna be rough. Got a cool for infrared. Uh-oh. Whole lot of ammo I can't use. Okay, this is gonna be good to remember, but I won't. So that's all I can get here without another card. So first floor, which I think is closed. Yep, so it took me straight to the second. I got the key card, so I don't need to be here. Now, I crashed the party on the third floor. Okay. Crashed the party on the third floor, and this one I went down the dust chute to the basement. So we'll see if there's a fourth floor quick. So, get off at one, there's gonna be something at one. Cause I did miss most of it because I had no keycard. Did, did I have the time? Nice. 
hole. Okay. Let's ride this out quick. standing most of the time. Oh, just a hiding hole. Okay. God, okay, this, this is going to be another, another Metal Gear. It's just kicking my ass left and right. I'm not here, go away. It's just so confusing to know what they can and cannot see. You ain't seen me. It was behind the tank. Oh god. Okay. Immediately. Start of the game. Don't know where to go anymore. So I get back in the elevator. Oh, hello. Can you stand up, please? I guess that was just their first little easter egg bit. Oh, 
Oh god, I'm gonna have to go back in the dust chute again. I need health. Let's go, we'll go to the basement manually and then go all the way up. Is that a little kid? Wait, wait, they ain't got, like, child soldiers, right? Like, like in... Five? Because in five, they... were like, that's a, that's a no-go. Alright, so we got some garbage. Big chestnut. Why can't you eat that? If you were a big boss, you would have eaten it. Alright, there you go. An extra ration. Alright, all the way up. Ooh, up to where? Hold that elevator. This is level four. Yeah, that's where I got the key card, and there wasn't much else here. I don't think. Explore. Uh, I don't know. Oh, or was this the dead end floor? Okay, so it was floor floor three, not floor four. Hope you guys are ready for the shittiest walkthrough. I struggle my way through this game, bumping at every door I find. Oh, gas. Ah, sucker. right there. Okay, so that's where he is. Because, yeah, that's the red square. I didn't equip my key card. Also... Uh-oh. That doesn't make me impervious. It just lowers the time. Gas mask broken. Hehehe, <laughs> <laughs> foolish foxhound. Dr. Marv isn't here. Figures that foxhound would use such a cheap transmitter. You guys are really behind the times. Oh, yeah. I am Black Ninja, former member of NASA's Extraterrestrial Environment Specialist Forces Unit. Gray Fox. That's that's the name I was trying to think of. Now let's 
see just how strong the world's most advanced Black Ops unit really is. Show me what we've got. Uh-oh. Oh, I got him. I was like, I'm dead. Snake. Who are you? How did... Oh. It's me, Schneider. Kyle Schneider from the first game? You were in the resistance at Outer Heaven. But I thought they killed you. So I got a lot to learn, Snake. I was almost killed, but not by them. By you and your country. What are you saying, Schneider? Snake, after you destroyed Metal Gear, NATO launched a massive bombing campaign against Outer Haven? What? All of us resistance fighters and the children of Outer Heaven, they didn't care about any of us. Oh! There was no escape from the flames, they died like animals in a cage. I can't believe this. Think about it, the children of Outer Heaven were originally war orphans and refugees from all over the world. They were a liability and NATO didn't want to deal with them. No. You're no different. They'll forget about you too, but he wasn't like them. Who? He came and saved us from annihilation. He gave us what we'd done. He gave us a new land to call home, a new family. He did, you mean. Snake, you'll understand soon what a wonderful man he is. Snake, are you dead? There's no hate between us. I'll tell you where Dr. Marv is. It's what he would want me to do. Find the man who's guarding the cell where Dr. Marv is being held. Call the man and he should lead you straight to the cell. You can tell him by his green beret, he should be on the first floor. First floor, green beret. Okay. And he exploded? Thank God they healed me. We're still on this whole separate card thing, though. barriers. Okay, it's all making much more sense now. Alright, I'm going down. First floor. <sighs> Starting at the basement. Gotta get that ration back. I only got one bullet left. Last bullet, I'll shoot the kid. Don't do that. <laughs> it's a bad idea. Hey. 
go. Why is there... Excuse me. Why is there kids in the sewers anyway? Or is this the room I'm thinking of? Yes. Oh no, that opened. I was really hoping it wouldn't. That's my only bullet! Ow. No one can say I'm here if everyone's dead. That's the motto I live by. Plastic explosives, okay. Not what I was expecting. Uh-oh. Oh my god, I almost died. Submachine gun. That's more like it. Alright, just a hidey hole. Continue, don't end. No, I can't have a repeat of the first day. Why does it say I got one bullet? Okay, it's just when I first got here. I was concerned for a second. Out for these pitfalls. Like that one. That's nice. This didn't open? Okay... Nonsense! Yeah, I'm not here. Go away. 
it's not going away. Why don't you activate the trap? That opened so quick. It's trying to get me. Oh my god, okay. First floor, green beret. I need to do that before I forget. So that'll be where I think I ended. Or is this? This is this room. Uh, let me try. Yep, there we go. There's gotta be... Nice, nice, okay. Like, there had to be something in one of these doors, and I knew it. There's so many people near the elevator. How did you see me? I panicked. I hit up. Guess what? Ah, uh, it's no fair. I can't tell what you are. Set up higher. I can just. I have a feeling it's him. That's why they're hiding his head. You gonna turn down? You're a liar and a cheat. Oh my god. Okay. I'm not here. Go away. I need to find this green beret bastard. That's a camera. Better not see me. Okay. 
Green Beret, hello. Okay then. I guess uh, that answers the question of do you let him see you and have him leave you? The answer is no. Okay. God damn it. Okay. Since I'm here, is this open? Alright, level two into here. Green Beret's gone. screen on the map, he should reload in, which is just one more panel. Yep, there he is. Secret path. Oh, <laughs> okay. That's how it's gonna be, huh? This is actually pretty cute. I like this. walking. Oh, there I am. I was like, did I just walk straight into him? first came in. Is this man th literally walking me in circles? Oh, shit. I wasn't expecting the sprint. This man's like, if someone's following me, I'm booking it. They're gonna slip up. Oh, 
Okay. Oh. Okay, hold on. Ooh. Okay, I didn't know we could do that. I've got ten. Oh, I did not mean to. Oops. Okay. It's a tap code. They were used to communicate in North Vietnamese POW camps. Before that, they were used during the Korean War. Instructions on deciphering the code should be written in the software. The software manual. Is he telling me to look at the game case? Because I don't have the game case. How am I supposed to look at the game case? I'm going to hide this so you can see everything underneath. Uh, so I can go to my main menu. Is there like a picture of it somewhere? No. No, there's not. Okay, and then I ended up letting you see it all anyway. What was the point? Okay, you know what? I made good headway. Figuring this out, I think, is going to be a bit more of a pain than I want to deal with right now. So I'm going to call it for today. Maybe look it up. See if it's... See the online manual. Okay, how do I get to the online manual? I think I'm gonna have to figure that out. But anyways, this is gonna be it for me today. Thanks everybody for joining me, and I'll see all you guys in the next one. Thanks, bye.